welcome welcome to paris it's the same room as usual however wow i have a view on the eiffel tower i have been waiting for this i knew that one side of the hotel was the good side and i got it then if we go here hello we have the nice and clean bathroom So I just landed a little bit ago. Uh, we left with a small delay, but it's summer flying and it's the real first summer since the pandemic. So it's a little bit crazy like everywhere. So it's to be expected. Therefore, one hour delay, I consider it to be on time. Like it's not that bad. It is 1 p.m. here. I'm not going to sleep, not this time. I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna do. I had, ooh, that's pretty. But I'm feeling just a tiny bit tired. I mean, it's normal. But at first I was planning on walking to Le Musée du Louvre, but it's quite a good walk. And because I'm tired, I'm not sure if I really want to walk there. And if I do, will I have the energy to come back? I feel like I could just take the metro, but I've never been in the French metro here in Paris. I speak French though, so like, it's not the end of the world if I don't know how it works because I can speak to like anyone here since I'm bilingual. But I'm just not sure if this is an adventure I'm willing to hop on today. I'm all ready. I just touched up my makeup really quick. Wow, the glow. And that is the outfit of the day. Also, I decided that I would take today very easy. I don't want to stress myself too much. Wherever I end up is wherever I'm going to be. I ended up going shopping. Unfortunately, I had to leave my phone here to charge because it was completely dead. Also, my grocery shopping was very productive and it was um, <clears throat> very expensive. I swear my family is lucky. They got some really good stuff from me. Okay, so like that's all the cheeses I got. One, two, three, four, five, five cheeses. Um, I think we're gonna have a nice platter when I come back home with some charcuterie. I got the same olives as last time because they were delicious and we ate them all in one night. And because we loved this brand so much, I also got another flavor to try. Then I got those cashews again because um, honestly, they were delicious. And offered a clothing, why not a little haul? tower from my room living the dream so exhausted honestly when i landed from my flight i was great like i was dancing in the galley after working at Athen, this flight felt so short and so easy we were landing i was like wait really so anyways those olives are olive verte à l'ail so garlic olives Mm. Oh my god, wow. Mm. Honestly, if you're a crew member and you go to Paris, screenshot this. This is amazing, like this brand. My mom is going to be so pissed. She got COVID and now she can't taste anything. <laughs> It's 
p.m. and look how bright it is. Right now in Montreal, it would be pitch black. Honestly, it's such a nice feeling because you have so much more time to enjoy the day. If I had more energy, I would walk to the hotel tower. I am so full, I could roll to the hotel room. Well, I just had a mental breakdown on FaceTime. That's the after. Just feeling fabulous. Sometimes things can get overwhelming, but when you're done crying, you try to look at the bright side, you try to find one, and you look at it, and you stare at it so you don't lose it. Because, you know, sometimes it's hard to find. I'm moving to Vancouver next month, and it shall be exciting and eventful. Alright, so I'm just finishing up packing and putting on my uniform, and I'll go down for pickup. It's in like 15 minutes. Thank you so much for watching. It wasn't the vlog I was expecting. Um, I think I just got too tired and also I'm like very stressed recently. So I need to take care of that. But thank you so much for watching. If I'm capable, I'm going to try to pick up maybe something on overtime before the end of the month. Otherwise, this is going to be the last vlog of the month of June. I don't know how I feel about July, but it's coming regardless so i'll see you in july for sure